Hello everyone, welcome to our YouTube channel VKR Soft. In this video, we are going to discuss about UDS negative response code. First, we can start to understand about what is UDS. UDS stands for Unified Diagnostic Services. It is defined in the ISO 14229 standard and it is a standardized communication protocol used in automotive industry to perform diagnostic and programming tasks on electronic control unit. First, we can start to understand about what is NRC and why NRC is important in diagnostic. NRC is nothing about negative response code. So, when a diagnostic tester send a UDS request to an ECU, the ECU can respond in two ways. One is positive response, another one is negative response. If the request is processed successfully, then it is called as a positive response. Whenever the request is cannot be processed due to an error or some condition not being met, then it is called as negative response. What all are the NRC ranges will be supported according to UDS protocol. If it is 00, then it is positive response. That will be used internally by an electronic control unit. When the range between 0, 1 to 7F, that is a standard negative response codes will be supported by UDS. That is mainly for protocol and communication related. And 82 FF, this is for custom NRC. That means as a developer, we can use it for application specific or special condition based on the requirement. This is the structure of a NRC. So, here when the tester requests with 1001, ECU is not able to process it, then it is responding with a negative response. So, how we can understand the upcoming request is a negative response or not? That's where your NRC byte structure will play a major role. If it is with 7F, then it is indicating it is a negative response. Then the second byte echoes the requested SID. So, here 10 for diagnostic session control and third byte is a real NRC, negative response code, here 22, that is indicating conditions not correct. Now, what are the common NRC values are used in UDS protocol? There are a lot, but here I have mentioned some. So, 10, it means general reject, that means ECU does not support the requested at all. 11 service not supported so we used to configure the diagnostic services if you are configuring out of range for an example if we have a 10 11 and we have a 22 2e these all are the possible services diagnostic services in uds but when you are configuring something like out of this then it will respond with 11 that means service not supported 12. Subfunction not supported. The subfunction not supported means we have a subfunction for 10 services. So you have a 0, 01, 0, 02, 0, 03. If you are requesting with 10 with 70, then in the case you will get a response like 12 as a NRC. That means subfunction not supported. 13. The incorrect message length. So incorrect message length means the request format is wrong. You can consider in such a way or you already configured. You are expecting with some specific length, but somebody is requested with some more length. Then in the case, you will get 13 as a NRC. 21. Busy repeat request. That means ECU is busy. You have to retry later. 22. Conditions not correct. So in your development, you are checking for some precondition to met that precondition. If that not met, then it will return with conditions not correct. 24. Request sequence error. You can take one example in the request routine. 51. You have a subfunction 01, 02, 03. So you have to first start a routine, then you have to stop a routine. So before start a routine, if somebody requested with stop a routine, then it will respond with 24. Request sequence error. 31. Request out of range. It is an invalid data or out of range DID. At the time, the client will or the tester will get 31. 33. Security access denied. So, security access failed or not unlocked. In that case, we will get security access denied NRC. 35. Invalid key. So, wrong key provided during security unlock, especially on the 27 servers. At the time, we will get a 35. 78. Request is correctly received and response is pending. So, this is indicating ECU still processing. Wait before sending next. In that time, you will get 78. And 7E, sub not supported in particular active session. 7F, 
service not supported in active session so these all are the common nrc values which will be you can see it in your day to day life but there is a lot of nrcs basically there and it will be supported by uds protocol hopefully you will get a data about common supported nrcs and why nrcs important in a diagnostics hope you like this video thank you so much